Hey guys, I have a quick tip for you on how to either hide or remove shapes from outside the artboard. The first thing we're going to do is hit M or click on the rectangle tool and create a rectangle the size of the artboard. Next, we're going to select all of our shapes and right click make clipping mask. Now, all this does is constrain it within the shape, which I don't love in my daily workflow because I have to double click to get into any of the shapes. In method number two, we're going to keep that same rectangle and select all, but instead of using the clipping mask, we'll hit Shift M and hold down Alt or Option as we drag over each one of these shapes. Just like that, after deleting the rectangle, you'll see that our shape fits perfectly in the artboard. The only problem with this one is that we do lose our shape. So this is great if you're cleaning up after you're done with the project, but otherwise I don't recommend it while you're working on it. In our last method, this is going to be the easiest one. If you just want to hide the gray, all you need to do is go to view, trim view. Just like that, you get to keep the shape and just like Photoshop, you don't see anything that goes off your edges. If you like this video, hit like, subscribe and notify. While you're at it, come join our Facebook group named Graphic Design Portfolio Growth Strategies, where you'll learn to build, improve, and maintain your portfolio. The link's in the description below. Thanks for watching and stay creative.